morning, everyone. Today, I'd like to share with you some of my top tips for how to get the most out of your distance learning. The first thing you'll need to do is find an area in your house that's appropriate for your child's learning. This should be a place that's quiet, well lit, and has access to all the resources you might need. If you have a set of headphones, I highly recommend that you use them. Do what you can to help the children establish a routine. Choose time each day that you're going to use to complete your distance learning. Before you begin, take some time to go through the list of activities that have been assigned for the day. Make sure children know what they're learning and what will be coming up next. While you're supporting your child at home, you may become tempted to help them answer some of the questions. I just want you to remember that learning is an individual process and we're not expecting children to be able to answer every question 100% accurately. Please encourage them to have a go and try their best. Teaching can be a very, very challenging job and it'll be very natural for you to feel stressed or pressured while you're helping your child. But what I want you to remember is that you're not in this alone. In addition to having us here at the school ready to help, you also have all of the other parents who are at home doing the exact same thing as you. As a teacher, we'll often talk to each other about, about what went well with our lessons and what we could do differently. And, and I suggest that as parents, you do the exact same thing. If you found an idea or a way to help that, that worked really well for you, please share that. Also, if you tried something and it failed miserably, please share that as well because that can help someone else. As we planned and prepared all these resources and activities for you to do at home, um, we've really, really tried to make sure that they are, they're light, they're fun, and that they keep our children's progress moving forward. What I ask is that as you're working with your children, have fun. If you find yourself getting stressed, take a break. Within each day's lessons, you'll find brain breaks. These are short little sessions where you can get up, you can dance around, and you can clear your mind before you go back to the learning. I hope that these tips have been really helpful, and remember, we're all here to help you if you need us.